think the structural female operators are even fewer, maybe 1%. I've read 1%. So I think if we... um, It's not just uh, the patients, right? There's fewer structural female operators as well. Mm -hmm. uh, overall, interventional female operators are 3 to 6% or right. so. And I think the structural female operators are even fewer, maybe 1%. I've read 1%. So I think if we can, yeah, I feel like if we can get all the structural female operators together and, you know, um, try to enroll more patients, probably we'll get more female patients into our clinical trials and then be able to do trials that are specific to women. For example, the SMART trial right. uh, just came out recently and we know what exact valve is good for women um, in, in small annuli. So women have small annuli, so that's that's what the trial shows one valve may be better than the other. Mm -hmm. So if you do trials like that, I think, uh, you know, we'll have sex-specific data and it'll in, in, improve care for uh, our female patients.